Thanks for joining us at 630. These baby otters lost their mom before they could even open their eyes. Yeah, but thanks to a wildlife rescue, they're being given a chance to thrive on their own. Fox 35's Esther Bauer has an update on how they're doing and what you should do if you come across something like this. You hear them before you see them. These two and a half month old otter pups are brothers. They're on their own together after their mom was hit and killed. These guys were in a little bit of trouble. That's where vet tech Corey Mullen comes in. We have to take on a surrogate role here, yes, but it's a very delicate balance between providing them everything that they need and not letting them get too attached to us. The river otters were only weeks old when they came to the Florida Wildlife Hospital. Their eyes were still shut and they couldn't do anything on their own. And when they're really little, we have to stimulate them to urinate and defecate before each feeding. In just over two months, the vets have taught them how to use the bathroom and how to swim. Hi. The current challenge, how to eat on their own. They love the bottle and they don't want to let it go. <laughs> But it's really important that these guys start learning to use their teeth. While the brothers are beyond cute right now, it's important to remember they're still a wild animal. And it isn't safe for the otters or for humans if people get too close. It's very dangerous. It is birthing season for otters, so this means we all could start seeing more of them out in the wild. If you ever do see an injured otter, though, you need to remember humans should not touch them. They do carry rabies, and that is is fatal for humans. So we really don't want them to think of people as friends because they need to be wild and go back into the wild. Tracy Frampton runs the Wildlife Hospital. She says it will be about nine months before they can release the otters. They aren't naming the duo because they can't get too attached to the wild animals they rehabilitate. Humans are here to help for now, but hope to see them out of this bathtub and on their own later this year. These guys are definitely a very special species. Reporting in Melbourne, Esther Bauer, Fox 35 News.